Hey guys, F -f Fire here, bringing you another F First Impressions video. This time we're checking out uh, Oaken. This game is uh, currently available in the Xbox Store for a price starting at $20. Uh, at the time of me recording this, it is also on sale, so you could save a couple dollars, but let's uh, d d dive on in and see what we think of the game. I, I, ho I hope you're having a great day so far, and I appreciate you stopping by the channel. Okay, so to defeat all the enemies... Oh, whole day to pick up. Oh. Hex tiles. The lady, okay, so. These are your attack and health, okay. Pretty, pretty basic. Units can move once per turn. Oh, you pick which way you're facing. Oh, okay. And also cancel. So we'll move our first card spell, cast in order to target your line of sight. So how do I do that? Oh, little left bumper. Who do we want to hit? Oh, okay, so everybody has line of sight. Let's get this straggler off to our left. Okay, using cards and skills drains up your Lumi, but it's pull refills and goes larger every turn. Okay. Pretty pretty simple. I wonder if we can only attack people. Uh, oh, okay, the frontal possible ways they can attack. Got it. M makes sense. Okay, we can un undo things. Let's attack your enemy enemy with a frontal arc. Now let's finish this. this is summon me adjacent to an enemy. Okay. So let's get uh let's get some backup out here. Oh, so when you came in, did that kill them? Okay, so maybe like an entrance attack. That's cool. Okay, world map. You can track its journey. Okay, let's uh let's dive on into the game. Did we get any like achievements or anything? No. Seems kind of like it'd be cool to get a tutorial achievement at least. Okay, so we have to protect this thing to defeat all the incoming enemies. Completing the side objectives. Oh, okay. Protect the sacred tinker. So, is what is the sacred tinker? I don't know what that is. But uh, let's uh, hit this person as hard as we can. Oh, it gets like an attack back. Okay. Can I do a spell too? I can't reach anything. So we'll end the turn with the, 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 that one. So do they get to attack me now? Oh, no, no. I did an undo. That's not what I wanted to do. Crap. So what if we do this effect? Okay, we only lost one of our thing now, which is fine, I guess. I don't know how we switch our characters, or... Oh, I guess we're just trying to keep that thing safe. Uh, we need to destroy this thing, I think. No, let's, uh, let's back up. Maybe that's not what we need to do. I think that maybe is telling me that more enemies are incoming. Can I still attack though? Okay, I can attack. They are gonna kinda get some kickbacks on me, which is fine. Okay, we gotta do some damage to this unit here, I think. Uh, this one doesn't do an attack, I don't think. But I think we want to stay here and be ready for, like, an another unit up top. Did we, did we do it? Okay, we did We did it. You, you, we get re rewards. Diligent wisp. So, I'm assuming it's, like, deck... Yeah, it's, it's a de deck building combat game. Uh, we can craft cards. You have a wisp, dragon, a 
spirit to enhance it with new ability. Oh, so you get to like upgrade cards with these. That's that's pretty c cool. Uh, I can smell wisps. So do we go to the n next level? Yes. Okay. Cleanse the terrain. Okay. Let's uh, keep going. So so far controls aren't too bad. That thing looks uh, pr pretty big. We go further. You need to cleanse this eclipse terrain. Levels. We have various objectives this time. We don't need to focus on defeating all enemies. Um, what do we do to cleanse terrain? If access skills, custom limit can be used once per turn. I don't know what that means, but uh, let's uh, let's use that. Did that just like cleanse that? Okay, I think I think so. Can we play a card too? That would be cool. Oh, I think we're cleansing the things. Okay. Let's uh, end our turn and see what this thing does. Uh, let's drop in another unit. Can we get another good one? Actually, let's just destroy th this one while we can. Okay, so I don't know if we cleansed it but we'll just kind of keep pulling things in I think that's doing it yeah I think we just need units on those spaces but when they drop in it's kind of just doing the opposite of what we want so I think this might f f finish it no that doesn't cleanse it okay Let's have this guy kind of do some attacking. Maybe we can clear out some space for us. Um, yeah, I think that's all we can really do on the, the, this one. There's going to be another new unit coming in. So we'll uh, just continue our advancement here. What if I just... Uh, yeah, I'm going to force it so this new unit only has one space it can go into. Okay, let's uh, use our abilities here. Uh, we can't... Can we do this cleanse thingy? Yeah, let's do that. And I think we not knocked that one out. That, that wasn't too, too hard to do. So, so, so far, like, the, the controls are pretty easy. It's uh, honestly just trying to learn the mechanics of the game. M m more than anything. So, uh, give us some usual powder. Let's see what it's good for. Oh, so I guess we get, like, a, a little treasure thing. Uh, Lumia Dust. We can add Lumia Dust to s s something. Well, we upped our Stalker earlier, so let's uh, let's keep doing that. I don't really know what that's going to do for us, but I can only just assume it's leveling th th things up. Okay, defeat the enemy hero. We got this. So yeah, well, what do you guys think below? Uh, let, let me know in the comments. Like, it's definitely an interesting game for sh sure. We have fatigue, reduces max health of your units. Okay. Fortunately, we have a guide to power spirit that accompanies you on your journey. Okay, let's uh, let's just get some more units in here to really start helping us put pressure on this. Because I, I think that's really what's going to help us have an advantage. Can I undo that, actually? I just want to see, like, can I... Do I have... I don't have the walking range to go as far as I want, actually. Okay. So we'll, uh, that one attacked, and we'll have this one attack as well. It's a lot of health that we're going to have to chew through. Um, and I didn't mean to do that, so let's undo that, actually. Can I do this on this unit? Will it hurt them in any way? It doesn't appear to. Okay, so it looks like this guy might just run around us, which isn't really what I'm ho hoping to have it do. So let's, uh... Let's try to blockade this unit a little bit so it can't really navigate around too much from us. And we'll kind of just surround it with units and keep hitting it as hard as we can. Because that that's really what's going to help us here is giving it no, nowhere to run and no space to kind of escape us. Yeah, I think we got it. Let's uh, let's use this little uh, whip look at the thing and uh, f f finish this unit off. So th 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 there we go. Uh, we, we did it. Uh, oh, there's a little dialogue going on the bottom left. I, I missed that. I, 
I wish it didn't have that little I I info box covering it. Okay, so we won the, that one. You've unlocked a new guide? Cool. Uh, and a Lumia globe. Or two to upgrade a skill. Oh. Let's, uh, let's go, uh, upgrade our s stuff. For sure. Oh, so we can heal our character. Okay. And then we can use this globe to upgrade our impale. Oh, deal d damage four to a unit in your line of sight. In your line of sight. Oh, it's... L oh, it's train. Push the target away or ensnare the target. Let's do train. That sounds fun. I don't know why I did drain, but it sounded fun. Oh, you can choose the outcome you like the most. Choosing better rewards usually means receiving some fatigue. Oh, uh, look under the giant log. Check the narrow layer or search the whole a area. Um, let's just receive a stalker. Uh, and and I, I believe this game is also a roguelike. So you kind of go on runs and kind of rinse and repeat and go as far as you can. Use carving at least three times. Okay. Oh, those are a lot of units. Just shoot from afar. Avoid staying in their line of sights. Okay. Let's use carvings to reach them quickly to prepare for your attacks. We'll face toward this guy. Can we shoot anything in range? No. So let's uh, let's see if we can get some uh, new uh, new units to help help us out here, because we're we're definitely gonna need it. Oh wow, yeah, that's a those are some ranged attacks for sh sure. Let's uh, let's take this first one out, and then let's go ahead and use our uh, little whip thing here, spear. I'm gonna call it a spear. And uh, help ourselves out there. Um, let's uh, end our turn here. And it looks like we're going to get three more units on our next turn. That are going to come out after us. So let's just keep getting more, uh, more kind of defense stuff set up. We definitely want to make sure we take out any of these ranged units. For, for sure. And I want to just build up as much of our like inventory of attacks as we can so just just again if you, you're kind of a little lost here just to kind of check out how some of the things are going here you have this kind of like think of it like mana or points that you can spend t to buy the units on the bottom middle part of your screen and every turn you you get more more and more of those s so it allows you to then Play more spells, chain more things out, and try to um, do different things in the game. So it looks like we got something called Replenish. Oh, to destroy, destroy a card to gain Lumia Dust. Why would we destroy our Impale? But okay. Oh, wait. What just ha ha Oh. I'm very confused. But let's go ahead and uh, heal ourselves. And then we'll go on to the next uh, chunk of the battle. So, to defeat all the enemies and have at least five green uh, things at the end of the battle. What are the green things? Um, try to cleanse Eclipse terrain as it makes the enemy stalkers much stronger. Okay, I understand now. So, let's start off by just getting closer to these units. And then we're also going to call in some of our own support to really help us out here. And we'll continue to just cleanse things as we can. I don't I don't know why, but I always think I can attack right away, but I know I can't. So no, 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 no worries here. Oh, they're getting behind us. That's not really what I want. So let's, uh, let's do this. Rep no, let's uh, cultivation restore to two health. I don't think we need to he heal our units, but we do need to get some more of these guys coming in to help us out here. And I also think I need to get my uh, main unit here just kind of turned around and trying to address some of these other units because we are kind of getting a little bit trapped here, which is a challenge. 
But this is, I definitely would say the first encounter we've had where we're kind of outnumbered, so to speak. So we'll try to just uh, push through some of these units the best we can here. And then just continue progressing forward um, as we go. That should, I think, kill that unit. Good, good. And then we'll wipe out this one. And then let's get our other unit here just in position to take out whatever comes next our way. And then we'll go ahead and call in some additional backup from the other side. Alrighty, we should be able to move this, this around. And then let's, um... Let's heal our, our unit here that's definitely taken some damage. And then we need to start regaining some of this ground. Which I don't entirely remember how to do. But uh, we're going to do our best. So how do I regain the ground? That's what I'm not remembering exactly. So. Is this not going to attack? I thought it was an attack. Oh, there we go. I just didn't click it, unfortunately. Uh, can't blame user mistakes on anybody but myself. Okay. So let's uh, let's just wipe this guy out pretty quick. I don't remember. Can I attack those things? I don't think so. But we're going to continue just set setting our defenses up here. Uh, and then we'll knock this one out here and turn this one green. And then we'll get our next kind of go. Oh, no, 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 no. That ended a little too soon. We didn't get our fifth one. That's okay. We don't always need to get the bonuses. We're just going to go as far as we can. Oh, so we got another impale. That's kind of cool. So to defeat the hero and collect as much dust as we can. We can do this. But yeah, what do you guys think of the g g g game so far? Uh, personally, I like um, the, like these kind of like move, unit placing type things. Uh, oh wait, what does that do? Okay, should I? I, I don't. I'm assuming I should probably be worried about that. But uh, we'll kind of just uh, take our battles and face them as we can, and then let's uh, let's create another one of these just to kind of help help ourselves out. And then I'm assuming he's going to come forward after us, and he is. But we're going to come at him with uh, plenty of units to be able to really do the damage that we want to do. So we'll, we'll just give him a little bit of a poke there, and let's create more of these. Why not? Just make his life a lot harder, and we'll put as much greenery down as we can. Okay, I think this is going to be the point when we uh, start to come in with some pressure. And we'll just start hit hitting them with as many things as we possibly can. And also trying to collect some of this dust. Alright, so let's get all of our units to kind of wipe out these support units here. But also hit these main units. And then on our ne next turn, I think we'll be able to take out this guy. So his, his hero is going down. Um, I think I want to hit him with our big spear thing. Yeah, let's do that. And then why don't we just have our little plant guy here fi finish him. There we go. And we, we did it. That's all, all, all awesome. Okay. Oh, we unlocked the dwellers and we got an achievement leaving the... Oh, so I, I guess the whole thing was the kind of t t tutorial. Okay, there's two game modes. Journey and Relax. Higher difficulty levels will relax is provide stress free gameplay. Why we gotta dive into the stressed version of the game and s s see if we like it. Oh yeah, this is d definitely a roguelike. So we evolve our deck and then I guess we go as f far as we can. Ooh, there's some I interesting pathways on these trails. Let's uh, let's go this way to defeat all en enemies and destroy all withered roots. We'll probably play a f few of these, but I don't know how many we will do. At the start of battle, you can replace any drawn cards. Okay. That's cool. Oh, select the cards we want to replace. Okay. So let's, uh... 
Let's attack this thing. Why can't I attack? Oh, select the cards to redraw. Oh, I, I see what it was wanting me to do. Okay. So let's uh, attack these root things. And then I think we're going to use the spear. I guess on, on this root as well. There's going to be 10 enemies. That's a lot of enemies we're going to face. Okay, well, we're just like defaultedly killing things, which is always nice to be just doing. Um, there's a lot of the dark stuff. Nope, I don't want to move there. I just want to uh, attack this guy. And we'll end our turn he here. We'll carry over one of our little uh, manas. Oh, we are losing health. Um, I think we need to call in some just uh, other units to really h help us here. And I think I'm going to try to get as many things as I can that uh, kind of le leave us alone. We're actually really weak. Oh no, and units get to just come all from all the directions. Okay, well we're going to have to use our uh, wh whips here to uh, kind of save our butts. Actually, we'll just destroy this thing. Oh, it's because it's not in our line of sight. Okay, I understand. Well, I'm going to use the whip on this guy here. Because uh, otherwise, unfortunately, I think we're just going to end up dying. And that's not really what I want. But let's uh, take out this enemy. I think it should be an even trade-off. Okay, that was a good de deal, de deal for us. More units coming in. So, no real worries there. I think I'm going to do what I can to kind of just walk our hero away. And then just blockade them with just from getting hit hit by other u units. So, and then I think we need to get some more health because if we lose our main unit, we just kind of lose the whole, whole whole run, which isn't really what I want to be doing. But I'm fine if our units kind of just keep collectively doing trade offs. Um, I think these two can walk over and probably just trade out and kill this one. Yep, I think this is going to be the end, and I think we're going to finish out this for, for first one. No problems. Oh, wait, there's still another enemy coming? Crap. Wasn't kind of planned for that. But, uh, let's just get ourselves set, set up, and we'll, uh, we'll take it out. Oh, that's a tiny little unit. We got this. That should be the last unit. And we got the roots, which is good. So using those impales definitely helps us out there. Oh, we get a new card. Um, restores health equal to attack to all adjacent allies. Yeah, I want that. That's a super good card. Throne Oak Theory, uh, spell, choosing a common wisp. Receive Lumia Clove. Oh dear. Um, I'll choose a spell. What spell do we want? Oh, we can do shield. Give a nearby ally plus two plus two. Restore to yourself or a nearby unit equal to the number of adjacent. Now, let's get this aid. That seems like a pretty good one to do. To defeat all enemies and win before round seven. Okay. How, how many enemies are there? There's eight. Okay. Well, let's get a bunch of units kind of spawned in here for us. Uh, do we want to redraw anything? I think we do. So we'll just redraw that one, I think. And then I just want, like I said, as many guys around here with me to help uh, just take down these units. Uh, in the interim, I think we will uh, kind of just move and knock this guy out. We have a lot of health, which is good, but we don't have a lot of time to deal with enemies, which is bad. Okay, let's, uh, I don't think that aid spell is going to be what we want. Okay, we'll end our turn. We got some more units in play. Um, this guy does pretty good, I think. Yeah, he gives some kind of some buffs to our other units. 
And now we got that. That guy's kind of up there, all buffy as well. Um, and then let's uh, let's actually just shield this guy. Yeah, that does pretty good. So we've got a strong front of units on here on the side. Oh wait, can we just uh, buff ourselves? Yeah, let's do that. And then we'll have both of these units just beat the crap out of this one. Oh, they those despawned. That's fine. We can still take out this big guy. Oh, we could we missed. Oh dear. Um, let's create a grassy little spot. Oh, that guy died, which is fine. Which is fine. Oh, we lost like our little healer dude, which is kind of unfortunate. Uh, we're at round five, so we have to like start doing some damage to all these kind of units here. Why can't I do anything I'm wanting to do? Oh, it's because I'm not clicking things the right way. Okay, we'll wipe out this guy. Okay, we'll turn this guy around. I forgot the whole line of sight thing that I'm kind of screwing up here. Why can't this unit move? That's what I'm not really understanding. Okay, that's fine. Maybe it's because it's like a darky space. I don't know why why I said darky space. Like, that made sense. But we're going to have to wipe out these last two units. Actually, I need to undo that. Uh, these guys both have to hit, hit this one. Or I'm not going to get them. And I actually don't think I'm going to succeed this one, unfortunately. Because this guy's just... Oh, no, it, it did take him out. I think we're just finishing this with, like, no time remaining. Oh, no. I think, unfortunately... I think, unfortunately, we're just going to lose this one. Oh, no, we could drop him in. And that, that literally was the only thing we could do to win that one. Okay, we, we kind of lucked out there. See, I, I like these kind of games because it's like, you know... It's you, you give it your all and you just hope to kind of make it through. And I don't want to spoil too much Oaken for you guys, but I ho hope this was a great opportunity to show what I'm having a lot of fun with. This uh, fun little ro roguelike game with hexatile movements uh, on Xbox. And I hope you'll consider checking it out in the Xbox store. Uh, outside of that, thanks for just joining me on the video. And uh, if you haven't already, consider subscribing and Check out one of the other two videos that should be on your screen now. I hope you have a blessed rest of your day, and I'll catch you next time.